dumpster diving. What's next in the dumpster? <laughs> Kim Kardashian shut down a DMV and brought her team to make sure her photo ID was good. What if I win? <laughs> <laughs> Are you gonna fix the hair? Yeah. We need to powder like there. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Let me know when you're ready. Ready. Ready? Stop, no, dude. Just, we just move this. Dude. I, I, I promise. <laughs> you're gonna have to live with this for years. Ready? Four seconds. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Can I see it? Yeah. Mm, can we try again? Maybe if you, can you come out a bit more? So it's not so cropped. Not so, yeah. Let's yeah, is look. there any way to save this, do another and have them side by side? No. Can you just airdrop it to us really quickly? I think you could do better. Shoulders back. Yeah. Ready? Mm hmm. Wow. We're snatched. We're snatched. Good. Really. This one's good. It looks exactly the same as the other one. You got the shot. <laughs> I wouldn't say we normally get it. In two yeah. shots? Yeah. We trusted our instincts. First is the worst, second is the best. So the I am the second child. It was so funny. The whole team and dumpster in the writer's room was watching this video. And then at the end of it, <laughs> Better Fantasy was like, of all the things we've been through together, this really made me want to kill myself. <laughs> I felt the same way. I was like completely demoralized. All the crap we've covered on this sad, kind of dark and disturbing show. And it was Kim Kardashian getting her hair done, shutting down a DMV while 50 single moms probably waited in the heat to so she could take her second photo to make sure she looks perfect in her license. I doubt you even drive. You have drivers. Why do you need a license? Why are you making these single moms sit out in the in the hot sun so that you can get a perfect shot for everybody's license looks like crap. Is this supposed to make you more relatable or I feel like everything about their brand is how do we become less relatable? Right. And but people are obsessed. People are obsessed. I don't understand. People love the show. I saw it. I saw it last night on my new Stupid social media addiction. Threads. I'm a threader now. This morning I was looking at Threads, which is the new Twitter app, competitive app that Zuckerberg released. And he's on there interacting with people and talking about what he's going to do. And somebody was like, look forward to Zuck inserting all of the ads. And, and he was like, no, uh, it's the same thing we do with all of our platforms, which is we make sure it works. We make sure that the product is good and that people are liking it and that there is a clear path to a billion users. Users, and then we'll think about monetization. And I was thinking of just how sad. <laughs> I'm like, will you advertise on my on my dumpster fire with sixty thousand subscribers, oh, a billion users? And then they're like, and then we'll think about monetizing. I'm like, where does that leave us, schmuck? Oh, uh, please advertise on my dumpster fire. It gets twenty thousand views. <laughs> <laughs> and, like what? <laughs> kind of domination mentality is that you're just he's alexander the great of the internet wow he's going to conquer every single one of us and the funny thing about threads is you can't delete you because you log in with your instagram because it was sold as a companion to to instagram and so if you want to delete your threads account you can delete individual posts but if you want to delete your threads account you have to delete your instagram account account damn they've got you they've got you yeah yeah a billion people i'm like oh, please sign up for sad little dumpster fire. <laughs> <laughs> made me feel like such a loser <laughs> these people have so much power too just so much power i mean kim kardashian can shut down a dmv that's power yeah that is true power that's not like the kind of sad power we have to make the poor is just a, a a term that's used in the lexicon. Although that is kind of power too. Just no one acknowledges our existence. Right. It's now just become part of the lexicon with no one knowing where it came from. Damn it! It was here on Dr. Fire out of the basement of the internet. <laughs> that's really where we are. <laughs> Yeah, we're the Wayne's world of the internet. This is basically, we're basically public. This is a public service channel. Jesus, I want to be more. 
but we love it here. It didn't really get any less dumpster fiery once we moved out of the garage. What I realized is that the dumpster fire is in us. <laughs> the dumpster fire burns in our hearts. We are the dumpster <laughs> fire. No, it will, we could have a set and it's still going to be a dumpster fire. It's still going to be 20 people working for us. It will still have the vibe of a shit show. A shit show. Welcome to the shit show. Ooh. 